have done this. Shouldn't have done that. Why? We probably stabbed the oil. Okay, could you imagine it starts leaking out? Okay. What do we got going on today? You gotta say hey guys. <laughs> no, you gotta say hey guys. Hey guys. No, I hate that. Yeah. Hey guys. Today, <laughs> today we are changing the oil on my 2011 Ford Edge. So, we just got the oil a few minutes ago. Yep. You're gonna see our unboxing video? Yeah, <laughs> something like that. And yeah, so let's get to it. Let's get started. Shall we? Get right. <laughs> what are you doing? This is the top. How do you know? There's arrows, look at the arrows. Look at these things, right here. Oh, well, that's actually arrows. a thing? I did not know that. Yay. No! Wait, people come. I don't want to pollute. Damn. We have Quaker State non spots. And another one. And an oil filter. Woo! So. Okay, next. <laughs> Are you someone for this? <laughs> it's not turning. <laughs> Do I need something to loosen this? Yeah, probably. It's a bolt. <laughs> what, what do you do with bolts? Unscrew. <laughs> what size is it? Yes. Okay, 14. Okay, so it's not turning. Oh. I already want to go home. It doesn't fit. Next size. What are you doing? Aren't you just a professional? Mm-hmm. I've done this two times. Two times. There's a QR code under my car. Is there? Yeah, right there. That's the transmission, right? Mm, QR. Yeah? Transmission? <laughs> yes. See? I'm smart. And I'm putting my hair in oil. <laughs> Still turning it. No, I'm not! Yes, I am. You just turned it again. <laughs> no, I put the oil in also five feet tall, so I need a step tool. I drew a smiley face on that thing like four years ago, and it's still there. Um, but yeah, sorry I'm in a bad mood, by the way. I want to go bowling, but we're changing it with this oil, and 
waiting for a funnel because he doesn't trust that I can pour this. They're just sticking my head. You're gonna get it out of your finger if you don't move it. Is that enough, you think? <laughs> I didn't even move! <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know how to get all over my feet. Oh. oh. Oh my god. More importantly, I cleaned that truck. You cleaned it? All done. <laughs> there, I put it back on, don't I? Mmm. It's upside down. And that person's sitting in the background. Now we're gonna do an oil dip stick, right? <laughs> so what's it supposed to look like? I don't know what your plan is. I don't know, just look at it. Mmm. How's it look? Oily. Look good? I don't even know what the test is supposed to be. <laughs> <laughs> I just hope people do that. <laughs> you look good? You guys tell me. Yeah. Right, I got this one lubricated. So we wipe it off, the whole thing. A little wipey wipey, like this. I did it. Mmm. Wipey wipey. So now what am I supposed to look at? It's dry. Oh, now So now you check it. to see if there's oil on it. Wait, is what? there any oil on the stick? No. Oh, that's not good. Maybe you should add more. I just lost half my oil because I just took it all out like 14 times. Well, well maybe if it all wasn't on the wait, floor. Wait. You're scared. Okay, I did it. Everything is on. No. Nope. Everything is on. You didn't put the dipstick in all the way. Yes, I did. It's dippied in. <laughs> Get away from me. Hey, yo. Oh. Subscribe to Drop Detroit. Like, comment. I definitely just eat some oil. Like, comment, and subscribe to Drop Detroit. Hi. <laughs> 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 Grace, they're a big disgrace. Kicking you in the place. So, after I changed my oil, I had to fix my exhaust because a piece of it came off and I had we reclamped it on and then it fell off again. So, I had to take the clamps off so Alex could put a new one on and I couldn't get the clamps off. So, and you are going to hear it throughout the video. I know when she pulled it up on the ramps, you can hear it for sure. We'll have a before picture in this corner and an after picture in this corner of no exhaust versus exhaust. That corner. And we'll throw in an audio clip towards the end of what it sounded like when we were done. Bet you're glad you have an exhaust again. Bet you're glad I didn't say orange banana. Are you satisfied with your exhaust? I am. It sounds. I can't even hear it. It's how good it sounds. Yeah. Take the lid off. Whoa. <laughs> Bro. <Bruh. laughs> what? What? I saw that. What is all that? You're gonna get sprayed in a minute. You better watch yourself. <laughs> what? You're about to spray me. Ah! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I'm out of here. <laughs> I said spray the bolts. <laughs> <laughs> oh 
<laughs> I broke it. Okay, this one comes off. I'm surprised it is. You sprayed me more than you sprayed the bolts. Okay, get <laughs> so, just so you guys know, I'm more mad at the fact that I got faulty gloves that had a hole in them and then got <laughs> oil all over my hand. What about the oil on your forearm? Are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> Ayo. Hey. <laughs> so we finished up um it went okay i haven't changed oil in about a year year and a half so it was a little rough but <laughs> it was more than rough we got through it uh lots of kitty litter in the driveway to clean up my half messes the, half the half the oil it's on the ground it's okay though half um of it. he taught me how to properly check the oil levels so we checked him out and a little crazy um he taught me how to check the oil levels and basically spot on so that's good um but yeah hopefully i do this more often and it goes a lot better hopefully i <laughs> learn how to use tools as well because i could not figure out lefty loosey righty tighty <laughs> i don't know what was going on can you hear it a little rev yeah this is the sound of my car running a little rev Thank you guys for watching our video. Um, like, comment, subscribe, what you want to see next. And yeah. Now we go to bowl. Now we go bowling. Bye guys. <laughs>